Day is the day where you commit your lives to each other. In committing your lives to each other, you are also committing to be there for each other. This speaks of the importance of the relationship. It is something that through time you will fight for and fight to hold on to. And then it speaks of being one flesh. The idea of a loving bond that you two will create. Blake, your love, even in difficult times, will provide Megan the security she needs to become all that she can become in the future as you hold it together. Megan, the love that you provide for Blake in the good times and difficult times will provide the respect that Blake needs. The respect you give Blake will allow him to live and lead with confidence. When each of you live and love this way, marriage is a picture of God's creative power and his unconditional love for each one of us. These words spoken to each other are not just for today. They are to be lived out each day of your journey together. Your ability to live these vows in a constant and meaningful way will help build a marriage that will be cherished by each one of you. It tells us that love is patient and kind. Love does not envy or boast. It is not arrogant or rude. It does not insist on its own way, but the way of the other. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice at wrongdoings, but rejoices with the truth. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, and endures all things. Love never ends. But it says that the greatest of these is love. As you wear the rings you are giving to each other, they will become a part of who you are. Blake and Megan, I am proud to be able to announce that you are now husband and wife. Blake, you may kiss your way I'm feeling right now. Keep 